Welcome back to more Arthur um, character reviews. Um, this is Una Rocks, and today we are going to be talking about Jane Reed. Here we go. Jane Reed is the mother of Arthur, D.W., and Kate. <laughs> she is married to David Reed and works as a full-time work-at-home tax accountant. She is also the daughter of her children's grandfather, Dave. She's a female. She's an aardvark. Her birthday is during Return of the Snowball. Her hair color is medium black, brown. Her complexion is tan. Her favorite colors are violet and blue. She lives at her house in Elwood City. Dave is her father. David reads her husband. Arthur reads her only son. And D.W. and Kay are her daughters. D.W. is her oldest daughter, oldest, older daughter, and Kay is her younger daughter. Her job is an accountant. She made her first appearance in the book Arthur's Nose and her cartoon appearance in Arthur's Eyes, and she's voiced by Sa Sanja Ball. Physical appearance. Jane Reed is depicted as a tan aardvark with shaggy brown hair and wears a pink sweater over a white shirt, blue jeans, and white velcro shoes with purple loops. Like her son Arthur, the white shirt she wears underneath the sweater is tucked into her pants. Originally, she had a long snout and was based upon an actual aardvark with the rest of her family in Arthur's Nose. She and the other aardvarks were redesigned in Arthur's Eyes, which was published three years later. In the 1980s, she and the other aardvarks had their snouts gradually shortened until they became flat. In the book, she wore different clothes of different colors. In the episode Crushed, Crushed she, looked, she dressed like a princess when filling in for the head caterer of the medieval reenactment society, and again in D.W.'s Dream and D.W.'s Time Trouble, when D.W. traveled back in time. The difference between the costumes of the two episodes was the color. It was purple and crushed, and pink in D.W.'s Time Trouble. Her sleepwear is yellow pajamas with a pink collar. While she was pregnant with Kate, she was wearing a white collared shirt and blue jeans, and a yellow dress as a sleepwear. Jane's summer attire is often a cream-colored sundress and a red one-piece swimsuit with a yellow stripe or a blue variant with a green stripe. Past life. Jane grew up near an unidentified town on Grandpa Dave's farm, inferred as her father, Grandpa Dave, is said to have lived there for a long time. When Jane was a baby, she wore a pink dress with white cuffs, a white hair bow, and white shoes. Her diaper was covered by the skirt, and it's likely she wore wool diapers since they were in favor when she and the others her age were babies. During her high school years, when she started going out with David, she had longer, thicker hair and wore pink disco clothes and with white boots that were fashionable between the late 1960s through the 1970s. She is mostly known as a young, a normal person. And Arthur meets Mr. Rogers. Mr. Rogers states that he knew Jane when she was young. Other media. In the living book computer games, she had a light brown complexion and orange hair and sometimes straight hair. In Arthur's teacher trouble and a light complexion and light brown hair in Arthur's birthday. It was likely due to color and tone restrictions during the 16-bit era of computers and software. In those two games, she was voiced by Jennifer Hewitt before the cartoon show replaced her with Sanja Ball. In the later games, during the 32-bit era of computers and software, such as Arthur's Thinking Games, he, his, her appearance was the same as she looks in the cartoon show. Personality. Jane is quite caring and loving to her three children. However, some of the time, she seems to be passively exasperated on a daily basis because of the antics of her kids. She is a bit more strict than her husband, usually with D.W., as David is with Arthur. Arthur always refers to her as Mom, but D.W. usually refers to her as Mommy. She wants the best for her children, such as making sure they keep their rooms clean. Jane is also the most talented at cleaning the house. She can sometimes be quite firm when Arthur and D.W. are frequently arguing and quarreling. She also doesn't seem to mind D.W.'s bothering of Arthur, as she usually sighs and goes about her day whenever Arthur complains of D.W.'s tomfoolery. Jane also may have a more greedy and self-absorbed side. This is shown when she fantasies of one day escaping her family life to persuade personal interests and pick a car any car. Career. David and Jane prefer to stay at home. This is made possibly by Ed Crosswire. Both are hired by Ed and would have to get new jobs if Ed canceled. As for Jane, Ed relies on her for accounting needs. Other busy moments are during tax season, but she does not like to work long hours. Her usual station is in the den, and she wears casual attire while working. Some episodes she has worn professional attire and left for or returned from work at a large company. She rarely needs Thora, Catherine, Frensky or some other sitter since they are usually at home. The only three times they are needed are when David and Jane are sick or are going to a social event with their friends or when they need to concentrate on work so they ask Arthur and UW to stay with their friends or, or with Thora, Jane herself also babysits. All right, that's all about Jane, and see you guys later.